We're asked to describe the trace obtained by intersecting the equation of the quadric surface with the plane x equals 1. We will take a look at this graphically as well as algebraically. Graphically, if we graph the quadric surface and the plane x equals 1 in space and then look down on the x equals 1 plane, we can determine the x equals 1 trace. Looking down on the x equals 1 plane here, we can see the x equals 1 trace is a non-circular ellipse. And now let's see if we can verify these results algebraically. Again, but we already know the x equals 1 trace is a non-circular ellipse. To verify this algebraically, we substitute 1 for x into the equation of the quadric surface and then write the equation in the form of an ellipse shown below. So if we substitute 1 for x, we have the square of 1 eighth, which is 1 64th, plus Let's write the square of y divided by 4 as y squared divided by 16 plus let's write the square of z divided by 8 as z squared divided by 64 equals 1. And now let's isolate the variable terms by subtracting 1 64th on both sides which gives us y squared divided by 16 plus z squared divided by 64 is equal to 1 minus 1 64th is 63 64ths. Now looking at the equation of an ellipse, we need the right side to be equal to 1. So now let's multiply both sides of the equation by the reciprocal of 63 64 which is 64 63 Notice now on the right side of the equation we do have 1 because we have a product of reciprocals. On the left side, multiplying by 64 63 is equivalent to dividing by the reciprocal of 63 64 So let's write the left side as y squared divided by 63 64 times 16 plus z squared divided by 63 64 times 64. And now we can simplify before multiplying. 16 and 64 share a common factor of 16 there's 1 16 and 16 and 4 16 and 64. And notice here, 64 divided by 64 simplifies to 1. So the simplified equation of the x equals 1 trace is y squared divided by 63 fourths plus z squared divided by 63 equals 1. So once again, notice how this does fit the form of the equation of an ellipse, verifying what we found graphically. I hope you found this helpful.